Hey there everyone, this is Michael Duba with eXp Realty and during this video today, I'm going to answer the commonly asked question, is the Toronto real estate market shifting? We can see this article by the Toronto Sun stating uncertainty in the world could be cooling real estate market. And this to some extent is true. I wanna share with you this chart over here which shows how the average price has changed on a week by week basis. And we can see here the week of March 5th our average price was $1,996,000. Um, what's interesting is that it is 17% higher than where the prices were in 2021 during the same week at $1,708,000. But we can see that throughout the few weeks during the month of February, the average price was uh, somewhat stable between $2,050,000 and $2.1 million. And if we take a look at condo apartments, we can see that during the uh, week of March 5th, 2022, the average price was $829,000. Yet the week prior, the average price was $865,000. So is the market shifting? No, I think it is way too early to tell, but is it better to buy a property now than buying several weeks ago? I think absolutely. We're looking at listings and we're seeing it's far less likely that you'll be encountering a bidding war situation where you're competing with 10 or 15 offers. Right now, this is the opportunity where, let's say if you find a unique property, you may be able to negotiate a little bit less than the asking price, depending on where the seller has priced the property. But I do wanna share with you three indicators of a shifting real estate market. And the very first indicator would be that listings are starting to sit a little bit longer. So in a shifting real estate market, you will actually notice that signs may be out there for several days, maybe even a week, you will drive by the same signs without seeing the actual sold sign on them. Um, the second sign of a shifting real estate market is that there is an increase of listing inventory. Right now, we're seeing in Peel region, specifically Brampton, there are definitely more listings than there were about a month ago, but that's not the case throughout the whole greater Toronto area. As a matter of fact, if we look at uh, Toronto, and you can see here on the left-hand side, we have the list price. On the right-hand side, we can see the sold price. The majority of listings are still selling over the asking price. And indicator number three that we are in a shifting real estate market could be an increase of interest rates. And why? It's because real estate is fueled by the ability to borrow money. So just a slight interest rate increase could make buyers not comfortable going ahead and purchasing because there could have been purchasers that had pre-approvals for a specific amount of money throughout the past several months. However, now that the interest rates have risen, they may not want to purchase a property at that budget they had in mind prior. And I hope you all found this information helpful. If you are considering buying or selling, call me, call me, call me. If we are in a shifting real estate market, then you need the absolute best real estate agent you can find. So I'm looking to hear from you. And if you are an ambitious real estate agent looking to partner with me at eXp, then definitely contact me. My contact information is in the description box below, and I will look forward to seeing you all next time.